Welcome back to our channel, channel once again. And today she's happy. Yeah, very happy. <laughs> because you have no idea how many Trader Joe's bags are lined up here, right <laughs> next to me. Uh, yeah. So this is gonna be a massive yes. haul From of Trader, Trader Joe's. Joe's. So <laughs> it's one of our favorite places uh, because of one of many reasons is that we can find stuff that has neat ingredients. Neat ingredients. Um, so we love to get things like that. Yeah. Um, also, as we show you all these things, some are very basic stuff. Everybody gets onion, tomato, potatoes. Yeah. But otherwise, what we get from Trader Joe's specifically and why we get it, like what kind of things you can make out of this. Yeah. Uh, this chef is gonna talk about that. Uh -huh. So I'm gonna start rolling out things one at a time. She's gonna arrange all, those, all of those things and talk a little bit about and we're gonna start with the herbs that we got. Yeah, so the first thing we got is cilantro. So Trader Joe's has, if you guys do not know, they have really fresh herbs like mint and basil and rosemary, thyme and all that stuff. So this time we got uh, cilantro and they are potted in those tiny, these tiny pots, right? Yeah, so you yeah. have to take them out and pot them in whatever herb container you yeah. have. So we have half of the herb container with mint, mint. so we are going to also grow cilantro. So. Of course, we are not going to make chutney out of this cilantro <laughs> because the whole plant will be gone. Yeah. It's just for fresh cilantro to chop some veggies and things like that. So we got two of these right here. And they are sometimes even cheaper than what you can find in Lowe's, Lowe's or Walmart. Lowe's, Walmart so and all this stuff. And they're even fresh. Opinion. And we got a whole milk in here. That we are gonna make, make paneer from. Paneer for. So that's that. So let's just start Stop. rolling this out. I'm gonna give you and then you can show them. So we got this. So I got blue, blueberry lavender flavored almond milk. Right here. It has natural flavors and non dairy just so I can use it with my oats and all that stuff. So. Some onions. We have some potatoes. red onion. Some potatoes. Potatoes. Golden potatoes, right? Yeah. Golden potatoes. We got some quinoa. Yeah, we got tricolor quinoa because what I want to do is start mixing rice and quinoa and then make rice. Like not only rice or only quinoa but mix of both. We got some matcha tea. Oh, I forgot we got this. We also got matcha tea latte. I really wanted to try this like drinking this every day. So we're gonna do this. Uh, you got what some refried beans. This is the first time. That yeah, so this is the first time we're gonna try this. Get it. Yeah, refried black beans, we always make it at home, but uh, why not sometimes get it and try it? But this is with jalapeno pepper, so super excited for this as well. Uh, you got these two dressings. Yeah, we got the Greek style uh, feta dressing and this is champagne style vinegar dressing for our salads. Yeah, and we don't use dressings a lot. This is the only thing bit. that would have a little bit of uh, ingredients, you know, like preservatives or things like yeah. that in it. Uh, but we only use like a tablespoon of dressing for, for two, of us. you know, yeah. so something like that. So it's not that bad. And then we got salsa volde. Yeah, because we already flavor our uh, salad with cheese and nuts yeah. and all that stuff. So that's why we just add a tiny bit. And then we got salsa verde for dipping or making some, you know. Yeah, some and again, it has very clean ingredients. Ingredient. It literally has like tomatillos and some of the other stuff. And you got some kalamata. And I got kalamata olives to make what? Pasta? Pretty. You can add it in uh, primavera. Primavara. You, so you, she can actually make pasta primavara, which is another kind of salad and you don't eat, uh, add any kind of sauce or sauce anything or in anything. it, so it's really good. Yeah, pasta uh, salad. So this and you is can one I got. use any pasta, like wheat pasta, semolina pasta, protein yeah. pasta to actually make it. And you got this almond butter. Almond butter, right which yeah, I got the creamy one. And by the way, the ingredient is only almonds and you have no other preservative. So then we got this great. best chicken bone broth ever. Yeah. We have been trying to find this forever, remember? Like, yeah. so many places we have been online trying. and everything. Most, mostly, either it is too costly, the one we found had, was like a $6 of each. Yeah. And this one we got for like two ninety nine each. Yeah, and it and has like 10 grams of protein. Yes, so that is the main thing you want to look out for, that uh, if it's a good broth, it will have 10 grams of protein yeah. versus every other broth that you would see on the market, on the shelf will have like one gram of protein, yeah. I can bet. Yeah, so, but we, yeah, we did the research for that. So, so we, we got finally like, got a good chicken bone broth and we got four of, these, yeah, four of these, which you can obviously add to make any soups and stuff. And then this is the first time I'm gonna try a moisturizing cream shave based on honey mango with aloe. So I've never tried something like this. Yeah. Uh, she just spotted it out and I was anyway 
gonna Looking buy. Yeah. yeah, for shaving cream. So once I try this, I'll definitely do a quick uh, review review kind of thing. But yeah. I might just do it in a vlog. Or I might yeah, just yeah. we'll let you know. We, we'll and know. then we got Trader Joe's face and body sunscreen lotion. Yeah. Face and body. So this is SPF 30, 30. and this is again water resistant with vitamin C and it's all not oily and all that stuff. So that's why we got this. And yeah, if you want to know about any of the specific things, please comment in the section below and we'll tell you whatever like, your question is. So time for some greens coming yep. out. So we got some baby spinach right here for some salads and salad and paneer. paneer. <laughs> Stuff. We also we also keep frozen uh, spinach all the time in the fridge. Then we have some arugula over here, some Brussels sprouts to add in our salad. So I'm gonna toss uh, like toss them with some uh, spices and then air fry them, and then add it to our salad. And then we have some broccoli slaw. So this is similar to coleslaw, uh, yeah. except that it doesn't have cabbage. It has Broccoli with cabbage. Yeah, it has. Cabbage what, cabbage. what does it have? It has a shredded organic shredded broccoli stalks and carrots. And then you got some uh, shredded, shredded parmesan, parmesan for cheese. the salads and other the stuff. Salad, yeah. And then this is I found an habanero ghost pepper salsa. So this is a normal salsa that you get, but this has ghost pepper ghost and pepper, it has yeah. habanero. So yeah. we it's might just delicious. yeah we might just pair it up with some of the. And then Chips you also salad. got feta cheese to make feta lentil cheese. salad. Yeah, lentil salad. I'll definitely show you guys that lentil salad. It's so good. And then we got some uh, yogurt. Yogurt, plain yogurt. And then you got some mangoes. Mangoes! And it literally says in ingredients mangoes. Yeah, just mangoes. That's it. So they are just frozen and they are good for making smoothies, smoothies and topping are, them off. Yeah, topping in your oats and all that stuff. Now, Time for some cheat meals. <laughs> As you guys might know that we also do cheat meals yeah. um, once a week maybe. Uh, this time we decided to not cheat a lot because now we have some different goals yeah. to accomplish before October, right? Yes. Uh, maybe September 15th. Yeah. So, so that's why we decided to go a cheat but not like not, go all out. Yeah. So we got this organic spinach and ricotta pizza. Spinach and ricotta pizza, oh my god. Then we got our so pesto pizza with tomatoes and broccoli. Yeah, this is the pesto pizza with tomato and broccoli, yeah. And then we got uh, just gluten free cheese pizza cauliflower with cauliflower crust. crust. Cheese so, pizza. So some of these pizza have cauliflower crust, uh, yeah. so they have very less, less calories. calories. And, uh, and, and they are, trust stuff. me, the taste, they taste so good. And this is your bruschetta prosciutto. Yeah, I got this burrata, uh, prosciutto and ergola flatbread for myself. And then I got a mushroom and a black truffle flatbread. Oh, black truffle? Yes. Wow, with mozzarella cheese. Oh, it's going to be delicious. And then we got amazingly delicious stuff that this is something yeah. we picked last time and we loved we it. We loved it. This is a multi-grain uh, blend yes. with uh, veggies. veggies. Why I say this is great is because when you are trying to increase fiber in your diet, which we have been trying to yeah. increase, uh, that's why quinoa and all that cheese is not going to make like plain rice often anymore. Uh, this is great because it has barley, corn, wheat, rice, whole rice, black rice, Peas, carrots, zucchini, sugar, onion, salt, and olive oil, and salt and pepper. That's yeah, it. That's Those it. are the ingredients of this thing, and it has a five grams of dietary fiber and five grams of protein. So anything, if you're increasing fiber in your diet, you should always go for anything that's more than three grams, which would tell you it's a good fiber source. Otherwise, yeah. one gram fiber is not really or not really increasing yeah. fiber a lot. Lot. And it tastes really, really good. So this is the one. Let me get a closer look. I'm just showing you all the things, uh, giving you a closer look. Just if you want to go and get it for yourself, and, and please and feel free to ask us. Yeah and, yeah, and we can always like just comment and say, hey, what was the name of that thing you were talking yeah. about at 12 minutes and 36 seconds? <laughs> we can go back, look the video, and reply to you. I did pick the very tiny, tiny, tiny roasted garlic and herb butter spread um, because. I don't give up anything completely from our diet. Yeah, we don't. We don't. So we do eat bread. <laughs> we yeah. do eat carbs. Um, so, uh, so I was gonna try this. See how small this is. It's just tiny bit. Yeah. And, and yeah, this is the one. 
Yeah. I thought we had more of that rice before I showed it. I think we just have yeah. some other bag. So this, this is your chimichurri rice. And this and is another. This is the, uh, not the chimichurri, this is the mushroom risotto we got. So this is straight imported from Italy. We really want you to try this. And this is another, again, another packet of the same, of the same, same rice. rice. And then this is your chimichurri rice. Yeah, I also wanted to try this chimichurri rice with vegetables. This is the first time I'm going to try. I'll definitely let you guys know how it goes. And then the orange chicken, our favorite. We always get this from Trader Joe's. It's like so delicious. We also showed you how we made it in one of our vlogs, so don't forget to check that out. And then you have this. You want to try yeah, eggplant parmesan? Yeah, I want to try parmesan. stacked eggplant, eggplant parmesan. Uh, so here it is. It's kind of a parmesan lasagna kind of thing. Another part of cheat meal is this ricotto, ricotto and lemon zest ravioli. Ravioli. I love Italian. And another one is goat cheese and sun-dried tomato here. ravioli. So we are going to try these two. Yeah. Right here. This is the goat cheese and sun-dried tomato ravioli. And then we, you got some oven roasted turkey breast. Yeah. I got uh, myself some oven roasted turkey breast to make a sandwich or something, something like a snack. Uh, some basic stuff coming out. Green I guess peppers. this is green peppers. A lot of tomatoes. tomatoes. I hope they don't start falling out. No, they won't. Uh, we got some. Lemon. lemon and then what else we have here egg I think plant. this is eggplant yeah we got two eggplants then I think you got some avocado yeah avocados right here and then some uh, uh, sweet potato sweet potato that's it and Last but not least, I have uh, we pick some veggie sticks. Uh, it's better than going after, uh, you know, Lay's. Lay's, yeah. It's way better than Lay's. Um, this is the one. You can have like uh, you can have like fifty sticks of this thing with one forty calories and only nineteen gram of carbs. Uh, whereas I sure if you go and eat Lay's, yeah. you'll be like, and we love Lay's. Yeah, we, we love have Lays. a packet of salt and vinegar. Yeah, I'm not saying we never eat Lay's. We try to get the kettle cooked one, the not the, the one fried ones. Yeah. yeah, so we do get the kettle cooked one, and and do let us know. I'm sure if you guys are living here, um, how many of you do like uh, kettle cooked jalapeno flavor yeah, and, and salt, salt and vinegar? vinegar. That's our, our favorite, favorite Lay's. So, or, and if you know any other flavor that you like, do let us know. So anyway, yeah. this was the last thing that we got. And it was pretty much a massive, massive Trader Joe's haul. So I hope you guys you really like it. it. And yeah. maybe you got get some perspective uh, out of this. Um, what we get and why we get. Yeah. Uh, if you have any more questions, anything. Maybe you have picked few things from Trader Joe's that we didn't spot. Yeah, uh, do let so us know. Do let us know. Hey guys, go try this. This is great. Yeah. So we would love to do that as well. And, and we can you tell you for sure that all of these, they taste really good. So you have our word in there. You can just go and pick it up from the store. Yeah. If you like uh, it. It really, really tastes good. Yeah. Any stuff that we have here. So yeah. And uh, if you have any questions on a specific product, just uh, go and try to um, tell us, hey, what was that product? Can you give us more details? Yeah. Or anything like that, you know? Yeah. Even if you just pause the video and comment, hey, at 1256. <laughs> yeah, or just what say what is that rice saying or what is that bean saying, yeah. whatever, like whatever. Anything yeah. you want to ask. So I think that is it. That is this, it. Is, this is it. This was a quick uh, uh, Trader Joe's massive haul because yeah. we thought we got so many things. We have and to show you guys. Yeah, and we had to share it with you guys and maybe get some of the feedback from you guys if there are things that you love from Trader Joe's. Yeah. So uh, disclaimer: this is not a paid promotion. Yeah, this is not a paid this is promotion. We doing our grocery and sharing, sharing with yeah. you. That's it. 
So, anyways, guys, I hope you, you, you guys have enjoyed this. We'll see you in uh, next another vlog. vlog. And, and then, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. More and, and more. Yeah. So, uh, until then, uh, bye bye. bye, -bye.